Hey guys, Jamie here. Um, this past weekend was another free weekend for me. It was the weekend between um, my OBGYN rotation, which just ended, and it was before the start of my family medicine rotation. So um, I had a nice free weekend to just relax and recover and get refreshed for the next rotation. So here is what I did for the weekend. So for brunch, we went to a place called the Meatball Shop. We went to the one in Brooklyn, um, Williamsburg. Uh, we sat by the window, we were kind of people watching outside, um, had a really good brunch. Um, overall, just like a cute little shop with um, great food, so we really enjoyed it there. After having brunch at the meatball shop, we went to the new Fujifilm camera shop, um, I believe in the Flatiron District. Um, they had all this photography, like paraphernalia. If you guys know, Fujifilm has their uh, Instax mini cameras where you can, kind of like a Polaroid camera where you can take pictures and the picture comes out right away. So they had a lot of those. They had a lot of cool films and a lot of scrapbooking um, tools that I thought were really cute. Um, in addition, they had a line of cameras um, that are not Polaroid-like, but they're actually like mirrorless cameras. And I happen to be a pretty big fan of their cameras. Overall, it was a cute place to visit. Afterwards, we stopped by J. Crew. We wanted to try on matching parkas that J. Crew has. Unfortunately, they had an outerwear sale that was like 30% off or 40% off or something like that. But we missed the sale, so we ended up just trying it on together and not buying anything. Um, but the parka was super warm. Um, it was really cute. Um, I saw a catalog picture where it was a man, a woman, and a child, and all three had the same parka on, and it was um, it looked really nice and it looked really warm too. So after that, we went to Warby Parker. You guys know I just did the video on the home try on um, that you can do from Warby Parker. I'll put the link below if you guys are interested. Um, so I did my home try on, but I actually. As soon as I did the home try on, I got an email saying that Warby Parker came out with um, their winter collection of glasses. So I really wanted to try out their new line. I think I found the winner finally of the actual glasses that I want to get. So the pair of glasses, the design of the glasses that I finally chose for myself is called Louise. And it's a bit of a cat eye, but the frame is very thin and feminine and I just love the way it looked on my face, so that's the design that I'm going to go with. It was really hard to decide because I really liked all their um, new stuff. I also ended up getting a pair of sunglasses, but without the prescription. So it was really fun to just try on glasses and um, finding the right frame for my face. After Warby Parker, we went to the gym. Um, we wanted to do, um, get a quick workout in since we've been just eating nice food and uh, walking around. So um, I almost always have my gym stuff with me. So I'm ready to go gym whenever, pretty much. So I um, did a quick cardio warm up. Um, nothing nothing too crazy. Um, I think after I change, it's just getting on the treadmill is something that I just naturally do. It's just a nice way to get warmed up. After that, I did a quick workout of shoulders and abs. So I started off with overhead press, did some lateral raises, front raises, and some rear delt flies. So after doing the shoulder exercises, I did a couple exercises for abs, um, and then I finished my workout then. So after that, we went to a restaurant for dinner, just grabbed a quick bite, nothing crazy, um, and then I ended the night with some hot tea and some coffee. So this weekend was great because it was a really nice way to reset and get ready for my next rotation. I can't believe how fast time is going um, with every rotation. It's almost winter. I started my third year in July and now it's almost December. Well, it's it's November, but it's pretty much winter. And pretty soon it's gonna be December and winter break. I just wanted to give you guys quick tips about not getting burnt out since everything's just go, go, go and very fast paced. And it's very easy to forget how to take care of yourself and not get burnt out, which is very common in med school. Tip number one is cut down and start saying no to things that aren't important to you, things that don't make you happy. Um, if it doesn't add to your life, then basically it's 
it's okay to say no. It doesn't make you a bad person. It just makes you the type of person who is aware of what is good for you, what is bad for you, and it just makes you a, the type of person who is good at managing his or her time. So tip number two is something similar to what I just did. Between your rotations or even during your rotations or during your semester, um, take a couple days off, maybe just one day off if that's all you can afford. Take one day off, do nothing school related, do something fun, go out to eat, enjoy your time with your friends and loved ones and really recover so that you can be ready for um, your next challenge and, and dive into your work the next day. Tip number three is change your location. If you find yourself studying at the same desk, same chair, same room every single time and you just are sick of it, try going to a cafe or the library, a different library. Personally, I like community libraries because it's a lot quieter, less crowded, and you don't see the same people all the time. And you'd be surprised to see that the usual things that distract you or that break your focus won't be there anymore and you'll be able to do much better um, in your studies. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you guys like this new format of vlogging. Um, I know I didn't do a ton of medical stuff. I didn't do a ton of studying, but that's exactly the point of this vlog to take the day off and um, rest and um, just ready myself for the next rotation. Give it a thumbs up, like and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!